All right, action layers. Um, action layers have actually been around for quite a little while, but uh, I wasn't around, so I'm just now starting to dig into them. First off, what what are action layers? I think the easiest way to explain it is sort of an evolution. It's a blending of action sets and mode shifts, and it actually makes a lot of sense. So. These are all action layers. Now, for instance, if I go into jump, you can see that a lot of this is uh, grayed out. It's copying everything. So this is um, while I'm holding the A button. Let's just show that. And then we have all these new choices. So I did a hold action layer, go to jump in the jump, I changed gyro to be always on, because I personally prefer, oops, that up. I personally prefer gyro to be activated with a touch, that's, so I can recenter. that's actually maybe something to make a whole separate video about, because that's come up quite a few times, but anyways, so yeah, we have, gyro isn't on, but if I jump, then it's on. Which, you know, you might be thinking, well, so? I could do that with a mode shift. Correct, but you can only do one mode shift. And you can see here, I already have a mode shift because I also like to do gyro always on when I aim down the trigger. So, the action layer is a really nice way to let me apply multiple mouse to, pl to apply multiple gyro well basically to apply multiple mode shifts like all of this is um it could be achievable through action sets but this just makes it much more seamless it's like the same thing I don't have a grenade right now but when I hold Y that's also gyro always on and this is kind of screwy because I'm just, I deliberately wanted to make this profile as uh, similar to Crisis 3 as possible. And that was like, hold Y for a grenade. But that would switch to a grenade, it's just the game changed the way they handle grenades. But I still wanted to have that in there, so now you switch to your grenade and you can toss it. You could still do an action set. And I could potentially do one that mixed the aim, grenade, and jump all into one, and each button went to that action set, but this just, this lets me just easily pop it up there and get what I need. Like, I'm just thinking right now, like, I probably could have made, I could probably mix... All right, well, let's, let's, uh, yeah, let's, not explaining what I'm thinking, but I'm thinking I could mix grenade and jump, because they're basically the same thing where gyro is on. So let's try that. Sorry, right, here, we go, hold action layer, grenade. Toggle that multi button back on, put it in jump. Let's delete that. The grenade has it on. And the jump has it on also. Yeah, so that makes more sense. So yeah, I mean, that's, it's just, it's basically, the way I'm thinking of them is really a blend of action set and mode shift, but I'm thinking of it more as, what do you do? as a mode shift on steroids, really. And that's pretty much it. Uh, sorry if this is a little more rambly than usual. I'm kind of rusty, a little out of practice, haven't made a video for a while, but I wanted to... 
uh, really I wanted to cover these action layers for sure because I feel like the more I dig in there the more I'm gonna end up using that for a lot of things so yeah I think that's that's pretty much all I got just wanted to try to cover that briefly and uh, give you a little little look at This game looks so good, too. Still, after all these years. But yeah, I just wanted to go over action layers real quick, ramble for a little while, show you how I'm using them. I mainly... The main thing that stuck out to me was the, uh, like, hey, you can use that to pretty easily make some multiple mouse shifts. Because that has been a problem for me in the past. Like, I would want that left trigger to be a gyro always on with a different mouse sense with a different gyro sensitivity but then I couldn't put it on somewhere else well an action layer solves that piece of cake so yeah I keep doing that because I keep pushing B which is one you can always push the button to get back but I still prefer old habits die hard B is back to back out so, all right, that's all I got. I will see you around.